at the University of Kansas Medical School, <coughs> Dr. Driscoll, D-R-I-S-K-O, Dr. Driscoll, who worked with Dr. Rear. They published a paper on two cases of ovarian cancer who were both well after 30 months, and their treatment was chemotherapy plus vitamin C using Dr. Reardon's protocol, and they're both normal. And at the University of Kansas Medical School now, when they teach their medical students, they teach them that the essential treatment for ovarian cancer is chemotherapy plus vitamin C. And if they ask a medical student what's the correct treatment and he doesn't mention vitamin C, he fails. That's the University of Kansas Medical School, the first university to start doing that. Can I get that last statement uh, about the exam question again? Because I had the, um, the sound of the uh, suitcase in the middle of the sentence. Just, um, oh, did I touch the suitcase? Yeah. Okay. Uh, he, at the University of Kansas Medical School, if Dr. Reardon told me this, if they have the exam question, what is the correct treatment for ovarian cancer? If the student doesn't mention vitamin C, he fails. Vitamin C in conjunction with chemotherapy. Yeah. yeah. I'm not talking in terms of avoiding chemotherapy because I've had no experience with that. I've seen over 1,300 patients with cancer and only one or two refuse to take any standard treatment. So my experience has always been a combination of the best of modern oncology plus the best of what I thought was orthomolecular therapy.